Hey everyone, if you're thinking about having that wedding venue or possibly a bed and breakfast, then you've got to see this property. It's 58 acres with a unique setting and it's a unique structure too. Areas to expand for your barns and other facilities. Mountain views to put the little chalets for your bed and breakfast area or possibly for the wedding guests. Lots of parking space and it's only about 20 minutes to Gadsden and it's only about 40 minutes to Birmingham. So a lot of opportunities there. So stay tuned and enjoy the video. This is a Mediterranean Lodge at Blunt Mountain, St. Clair County, Alabama. You actually access it by going into Blunt County to go in, back into St. Clair County. As you can see, it's off Highway 231 between Asheville and Aniana, <clears throat> just minutes away from Trustville in Birmingham. You can really be at this property in no time. It's five bedrooms, four and a half baths. As you can see, it's a long, snaky driveway all the way to the residence. Those little dots you see along the road are pillars, stone pillars. Plenty of room, plenty of space for barns and cabins. It's one of those properties that, that you can grow. You actually got a large area that if you wanted to make a large riding arena, and you're gonna see that in a moment, you could actually do that. This has character. <clears throat> I'm pointing from the top back down. You can see the driveway. And you have this bluff area that you can actually have views looking towards Beeson Cove and um, Highway 231. You're not very far from Horse Pins 40 also, but you could build you another little cabin out there to look down in that valley, which makes it very magnificent. Especially if you're thinking about ever had, wanting to have a wedding venue, this could be it. Could be the vineyard, could be the wedding venue. Maybe you want a bed and breakfast. So come on in, let's take a look inside. I think you'll be amazed how unique this property is. It needs a little bit of work, but it's a magnificent. As you can see, you've got wood floors, you've got a half bath, upstairs you got a working elevator right there look at look at the art kind of a craftsman that he did right there it's just really unique the house is a block and at the end of this video you're gonna see some of the construction pictures of this and look at the stone there by the window I mean it's a really unique property if you if you wanted something unique that nobody had well undoubtable this this is it this could be that property that sets you apart from all your friends if you wanted something very unique and actually go in there and make it your own but you got tile backsplash you've got granite got lots of cabinet space <clears throat> a lot of room up here as you can see as we're walking we're walking obviously from the den or great room into this master bedroom you have a fireplace there we're continuing to walk into the master bedroom and this is the master bath you don't have a shower, but you could, you've could. you got plenty of room if you wanted to add it, change it up a little bit. Lots of counter space, as you can see. Lots of storage area for closets, linen closets, plenty of room for that. I mean, it's just very tasteful in the way that they did it, if this is what you're looking for. This may not suit everybody's needs, but it's very unique. The door that you see that we didn't come in goes outside and you're you're gonna see that <clears throat> in just a moment but I mean this is just a really unique and we're just outside on the same level there's three levels you're on the main level and as you can see beautiful views that's an apartment barn there well I mean not apartment barn but it's a garage with an apartment studio apartment but plenty of room back here for what you want to do so we're gonna go up these staircases really quick and we're going to slow back down plenty of room to build that right in the arena and observe from a distance I mean this is just really magnificent S excuse me for this moment here but this is the upstairs it's a bedroom and a bathroom and I forgot 
the video somehow. I don't know. Go figure. But you've got plenty of room to have a bedroom up there, then, and a bathroom. Very unique, especially talking about bed and breakfast. If you're thinking about the bed and breakfast, you have the working elevator to go from the main level to the top and down to the bottom and obviously we're at the bottom now this is probably a very unique place down at the bottom lots of areas to entertain and just look at the wood the woods just gorgeous and the stack rock pillars there and the post I mean you got a fire pit out there in the distance we're kind of walking over here I want you to see where we are at, at on the property at all times and, and that's that carport or that car garage with the studio apartment and we're easing back into the basement area of this home and when we walk in we're in the great room that little area to the right with the lights that you can see hanging that's where the elevator comes down stairs and that's another fireplace and that's gorgeous that stacked stone fireplace and that's what he intended to do upstairs but this is bank on property that is that elevator right there you have your laundry room is downstairs but you have the elevator to go up and down with ease you have your bathroom back here as you're fixing to see and you got two bedrooms so the basement has two bedrooms bathroom den the laundry area has the fireplace main level has the master bath bedroom half bath and the kitchen and the great room then upstairs is again at the very top of those that spiral staircase and the elevator goes up there too by the way so um you can go up and down with that elevator and it's working it's a working elevator so you don't have to have any worries about do we got to fix it well they've already had somebody look at it it didn't work it works now so no worries there at all but plenty of room for entertaining bed and breakfast wedding this could be the area that the bridesmaid and the bride gets ready downstairs as they're walking out looking out just look at that just look at that I, I mean i can imagine a barn back there as the bride is coming out of the house if you wanted to or bring her around i mean you've got the circular driveway up top and there's just so many things that you can do with this property lots of areas to expand for the family i mean you could go in there and put little chalets for the wedding party out on the on the back side looking out and this could be this one bedroom one bath could be where the guys get ready I mean it's just I mean it's here it's already done for you it just needs the love and the touch and the care that it needs for this property and I'm as you can tell I am very passionate about this property because it is just absolutely good look at that the fire pit the house that's the circular driveway just so much that you can do I mean it's already here there is more money in this property as it is in than what the bank is asking for I mean look at the glass doors I mean that's just gorgeous the way that is I mean just just a lot of character to it if you like care if you like me I like character and this property has a lot of character look at the tin and the wood the little room to the right is the bathroom I mean, this is a studio apartment. You got a little kitchen, you got a little loft area up there. I mean, this could be a great little weekend for people too. I mean, there's just so many options out here for this property. And if you're looking for something like this, give me a call. Call me at 205-478-4974. You do not want to mess this. I mean, I'm thinking chalets along the, the edge back there of Blunt Mountain, looking down the Valley of Beasts and Cove and Highway 231. Be sure to like and share and, be, and most important subscribe to my YouTube channel. We're always finding neat properties. Thanks again and, th and uh, if I can help you let me know.